Hello everyone. I just want to share um, a quick tip for everyone using um, the rather old Fairphone FP1. Uh, it's one of the first Fairphones and maybe you've experienced the same. It's terribly frustrating um, if you use um, GPS navigation, for example, in, uh, in the Google Apps uh, Google Maps app, not the Google Apps map, but the Google Maps app, then uh, maybe you, you were facing the same problem that this um, GPS navigation was terribly inaccurate and took ages to find your um, find your location. And I've so I've been you know I've been working myself through all these uh, forum entries about from users reporting the same issue and there, there were various complex to rather easy solutions and I just want to share the most easy solution that I um, had found and that is installing this app called FP1 EPO Auto Update. Technically I can't really explain you what it really does, um, that's beyond my scope. I just installed it from the F-Droid or Fostroid store and once installed and launched it will provide you with this interface. Oops, this shouldn't be <laughs> part of the screenshot. Anyway, so normally there should already be a server name here, which is now covered by this uh, overlay. Port you can leave empty. I think that's all default settings. I, I, I'm not sure, I don't remember if I ticked this one, but you know, that's up to you if you want to only use it um, with Wi-Fi. What you essentially just have to do, you have to enable it. It will ask you for a super user um, privileges, confirm, save it, force an update the first time and as soon as you have this app running in the background magically <laughs> my GPS improved dramatically it got so much better it's still not perfect it's still slightly inaccurate sometimes but at least it doesn't take minutes to you know to find my location so if you you know if you if you're still um, a long-lasting FP1 user, which is great, you know, sustainable, durable, um, but face the same problem, then do give this app a try. It's free and open source. Right? That's it. Thank you. And if you have any comments, just let me know, and maybe I can help if it's not too technical. Goodbye.